Right, here we have Sally. She's nine years old, probably about as green as you can get from a racehorse. I've had her for about three months. She's hacked with me six times and she's walked around this school with me once. Now, basically, whenever I start to work with a new horse, the first thing I look for is, will they go and will they stop? And uh, varying degrees of that. So what we're gonna be doing, just to get her accustomed to where she is and a little bit on my aids, so we're just gonna do some really simple walk halt transitions. There's not much point in bringing you freshly off the track thoroughbred into the school, popping it into trot, giving it a canter, and then finding out you don't have any brakes. So we're just gonna, whoa, good girl. All I did then was just a squeeze in my seat, squeeze through the thigh, and just close my fingers around the reins. So when we get to K, we're gonna ask for exactly the same thing again. Whoa, good girl and walk on, there we go. So this girl's easier to stop than she is to go. When we get to A, we're gonna ask again. Ooh. Good mare, walk on, good girl. And when you're going up a transition, what I do with these guys, ooh, this girl's a little bit sharp, is just soften my hands forward, maybe half an inch so that the contact is always going forwards. So when I ask for halt now, and whoa, the second she yields to my aid, I give her half an inch on the contact. So we're just gonna ask again in front of the camera, and whoa, and walk on. And the same when we go up as a transition as well. Now, I'm just gonna start to ask for a little bit of contact. Not too much, I'm literally just using my ring finger on each hand to gently just massage the bars of her mouth. Good girl, good baba. We're not keen on this corner of the school. I'm not quite sure why, it's very windy. Good, good, there you go. And, oh, good mare, and walk on. And whoa, whoa, good girl. And walk on. So this is really simple. This is lesson one. Will they go and will they stop? And whoa, walk on. Now there are times that I'll come in the school even with something that's more experienced and we don't actually get out of walk at all. Because you can teach everything you need to Oh, and woo, good mare. You can teach everything you need in walk. Certainly at the foundation stage anyway. Good. And as you can see, she's now starting to just play with a little bit herself. And she's starting to actually put a little bit of pressure in my hand and come into her own contact. And woo. Good mare, walk on. And all this with pretty minimal interference from me, really. There we go, good girl. She's actually starting to seek the contact herself. And whoa, good mare. And it's a pretty scary day for her. Good girl, walk on. There we are. Good.